What's up everybody, this is Q423 from EpicCouncil.com and I am bringing you the final part of the Executor DGX install tutorial. Uh, this video covers the computer side. Go ahead and open up JRunner. Uh, you should have already dumped your NAND twice. Uh, if you haven't, you just come over here and select your NAND type. I'm working on a Trinity and click read NAND and it, uh, it'll read it twice if you guys uh, set it right here too. I've already read my NAND so I'm gonna just go ahead and uh, open it up. Alright, now that you got your NAND read, as you see I've already got my CPU key so I've done this before. Uh, come on up here to advanced and click write DGX It'll ask, have you made a dump first? Yep, got both of them right there. They match. Working on a Trinity. Whatever your NAND type is. And it's going to just write that to the NAND. Once this is finished writing to the NAND, you want to go ahead and uh, hook it up, whatever method you choose. Uh, monitor com and retrieve your key. Uh, I hooked mine up to the TV and just turned it on. I was fortunate enough it booted within 10 seconds, so um, go ahead and go grab your key. Uh, I already have mine, so I'm going to carry on here. Uh, now that I have my key, I'm going to come up here and pick 14719 for a dash, and then select retail. I'm going to load back up in the source here, my original NAND one. And I'm going to create an image. Oh, come back over here and select Trinity. Create an image. And it's going to run through the stuff right here. Now what I'm doing here is creating an old 14719 exploitable dashboard. Uh, using all the same console information here. Alright, now that I've got that created... We're not actually going to do anything with that. That would be this image right here, my update flash. We're just going to load that into the source file. Uh, JRunner automatically will save it as update flash whenever you create an image. So we're going to load that in the source file. And now we're going to come back over here and click glitch pick whatever dashboard you want uh, I'm using 16197 and we're gonna come back again and click create image for Trinity again I'm working on a Trinity you might be working on a Corona if you're working on a Jasper with the DGX then congratulations you're special now that we've got that image created this is our new glitch image. So wherever you have uh, uh, it saved at, it'll automatically move into its own folder. This is my folder for this console. And right here we have our update flash. It overwrote the uh, 14719 um, rebuild there. So we're going to go ahead and make sure that that's opened up again, and we're going to write that to the council. Now, once this is finished writing, you're at the point where you can click over to my RGH install tutorial for the Slims, and take over from there watching how to install the Cool Runner and uh, uh, you're pretty much good to go. Everything's all programmed up. So go ahead and get your Cool Runner installed. Get all your timing figured out. Uh, and enjoy your new RGH console on the latest dashboard. Uh, I'm not going to make you sit here and watch it finish writing. So, um, hey, here's a button down here. You guys should consider hitting this. I know when my tax return comes back, these guys are going to get a little chunk. So, alright, thanks for watching, guys. Uh.
see how I stop this thing.